Mr. P, a brawler that was once overpowered and released, but not one of the worst brawlers in the game. But how did this all even end up happening? Well, to find out, let's dive into the history of Mr. P. On January 23, 2020, Mr. P was released. His attacks, super, and star power all worked a bit differently back then. His attack didn't bounce unless it hits a brawler or obstacle. His home base was a bit more tankier back then, having 3,920 health, which is 840 more than today. And his porters spawned way more often and were a bit more tankier. His porters had 2,100 health which is equivalent to today's power 11 stats. So his porters made him incredibly strong. But now let's talk about his star powers. His first and second star power worked very differently. I'll mention the second one later in the video. His first star power was handle with scare. With this star power, his attack will bounce every single time you fire its attack. So it doesn't have to hit an obstacle or a brawler. At the time, Mr. Free was one of the best brawlers in the game. On February 5, 2020, his 10 k star power was released. This star power worked very differently than today. It instead gave Mr. Free's home base 3,000 additional health. Which is insane because that means it would have 6920 health in total. Even though the second star power is actually good, his first star power is actually a bit more better. On February 7th, 2020, the 29 gem skin Agent P was released. I think this was honestly a cool design for Mr. P. It might be because of the color scheme of it, but it's honestly worth the price. On February 19th, 2020, they gave Mr. P his first nerf. They ended up decreasing his main attack range from 8 tiles to 7 tiles. On March 17th, 2020, they ended up giving Mr. P even more nerfs and releasing his service bell gadget on the same day. This gadget boosts the current porter on the field with attack and health. The nerf he ended up receiving this update was a nerf to his super. They ended up delaying the spawn of his porter by 4 seconds more. Mr. B ended up going to the top of the S tier. On June 3, 2020, Kyrus Type's new tier list was released, and Mr. B was still in the S tier, but went down a bit, being the second best brawler in the game. On July 2, 2020, Mr. B's tank and star power got a reward. So now this star power will also make porter spawn 3 seconds more faster. This was definitely improvement but they probably have to change the first one so the second one gets more usage. He ended up staying the S tier but went down a bit being the fourth best brawler in the game. On August 18, 2020, they ended up nerfing his home base by 600 health and nerfing his porters by 100 health. On September 10, 2020, he was still way too strong so they ended up nerfing it way more. They ended up changing to a supercharge rate was slightly decreased for his main attack and increased the amount of hits a porter has to do to charge the super from 16 to 18. On November 11, 2020, they ended up changing so his porter will return back to him when there's no enemy left on the field. On December 2, 2020, he went down in all modes except for heist and showdown. His nurse list is super impacted him a lot, making him go down. He's still in S tier but near the bottom. On December 15, 2020, they ended up buffing his attack by 60. In the beginning of 2021, Mr. P stayed in the S tier and went up in some of the modes. At the time, he was the 7th best brawler in the game. On February 12, 2021, Mr. P's portal reinforcement gadget was added. The next attack of Mr. P fires was spawning porter when it lands. Now this gadget at the time kind of broke brawlers because in big game the porters he spawned from his gadget actually spawn with max health Mr. P has when he's the boss. Note that this bug only happened when he was the boss. On March 15, 2021, Mr. P's health ended up decreasing by 200. On April 7, 2021, they ended up nerfing him really badly. They nerfed his damage by 40, nerfed the amount of health that the porter received when the gadget is activated by 50%, and also nerfed that damage by 23%. All of these nerfs heavily affected him and made him go down in several game modes, making him go down to the B tier. On June 16, 2021, his true silver and gold skins were released. On September 12, 2021, he ended up going last place in the B tier. On October 27, 2021, his class was changed from Sharpshooter to Damage Dealer. I have no clue why he used to be a Sharpshooter, and it honestly doesn't make any sense in my opinion. So it's probably a good idea to change it. On October 31, 2021, Count Pengula was released, featuring as Brawloween skin, costing 79 gems. In the beginning of 2022, he went all the way down to the F tier. On March 1, 2022, Mr. P got some huge changes. First they changed so his attack will guarantee bounce no matter what. His first star power also got reworked. So if it doesn't hit an enemy or obstacle, it will deal 40% more damage. You can do this every 4 seconds. They also reworked his second star power so now the portal deals 20% more damage and has 30% more health. So now both star powers are equally good and better. On March 31, 2022, the skin Mr. Flight got released. On April 27, 2022, Drama Mr. P was released featuring as the Golden Week skin costing 79 gems. On May 18, 2022, Mr. P went up to the A tier. His recent changes he got really helped, not being completely depending on his super. 
On July 21, 2022, Mr. B ended up going back to the B tier. The reason why is because the brawlers that counter him are really good in that meta. On September 12, 2022, Mr. B ended up going down to the D tier. This is the same situation as the last meta. Too much brawlers can pierce through Mr. B's porters like Janet, Carl, Amber, and Nita. And it's also because he didn't receive any changes. On November 12, 2022, Mr. B went all the way down to the F tier, being the second worst brawler in the game. Mr. P isn't that good in any modes because there's so much better brawler choices to use than him. On December 12, 2022, his damage was increased by 40. Also, Count Pankula, Mr. Fly, and Mr. P's main attack and superficial effects were slightly reworked. In this current meta, Mr. P ended up going up to the D tier. The main reason he went up is because of the damage plus he received. On February 28, 2023, Mr. P's class was changed to Damage Dealer to Controller. And this was the final change he ever received. So let's see if he ends up doing good in the final tier list. In the final tier list, he ended up staying in the D tier. There's still way too much brawlers that do his job way more better. And that's the complete history of Mr. P. If you found this useful, make sure to consider subscribing, and I'll see you in the next video.